supposedly 45% of the vote. It's KD. All right, Shannon, LeBron, four, receiving just 10%. We know you ride with him. How big of a problem do you have with this survey? I got a big problem with it. I do believe that Kevin Durant and LeBron James are the two best small forwards in the basketball. And maybe when KD is all said and done, KD can be number two. Uh, right now, I got Larry Bird as the second best small forward of all time behind LeBron. But I got a big problem with this. And even in year 20, and I understand LeBron is in year 20, he's not as athletic as he once was. Um, he doesn't play both ends of the court, court as well as he once did. But I still would take him over Kevin Durant because I just believe he can do things Kevin Durant can't do. Now, Kevin Durant can shoot the three ball. He's better from the mid-range. But that's not the only thing that goes into it. They both score 30 a night. LeBron is a better rebounder. LeBron is a better facilitator. And at this juncture, LeBron still can play defense at a high level, although he doesn't play it for the duration of the game like he once could. He doesn't sit in the chair for, you know, 25, 30 minutes a night like he once did when he was in his prime. But I still believe that LeBron James is the best small forward in basketball. What's blasphemous and just outrageous is that you got him ranked behind Jason Tatum and Luka, who doesn't even play small forward. Luka is a point guard. They listed Luka. Luka doesn't play any two. Even when Jalen Bronson was there and on the court, Bronson was the two guard. Mm. Luka is the point. That's just outrageous. This is, I mean, I mean, at some point in time, y'all just, just keep trying to find ways to disrespect greatness mm. instead of appreciating it. Mm. Respect it. We're talking about NBA GMs. Yeah. Not me. NBA GMs, right? Yeah, how many of them done one title? Uh. My guy do a better job of putting the team together than they do. Wait a second. What about Westbrook? Wait, I'm sure they got a bunch of busts on their team, too, but that's neither here nor there. But now, he was voted the second best power forward behind Giannis. Okay. Mm. And ahead of KD. Okay, I get that. Giannis is the mm. best player in basketball. He got voted the best player in basketball, and you want to start a franchise, you start with him. But mm. I got a problem with this, Skip. I do believe Kevin Durant and LeBron are the two best small forwards. Mm. But I just, I just got a problem with the order. And LeBron damn sure isn't the fourth best small forward in basketball currently playing. Mm. That's a bull job. So... NBA GMs, all of them, voted annual survey. Survey says KD gets 45% of the vote compared to 10% for LeBron. That's that's an avalanche. That's a runaway. I, the people in charge, the people in the know are the, saying, Shannon, it ain't close. The mere fact that they got Jason Tatum and Luka over LeBron should, <sighs> should disqualify everything else that they said. Really? Yes. You know that, Skip. I don't know that. And by the way, the guy who's most disrespected in this overall survey is Kevin Durant because of his disaster and debacle against Boston, the sweep in the first round. Oh, that happened. He's plummeted from like like even a year ago. Well, look, look at the top spot. The a year ago, the Nets were 72 percent of the votes to win it all. And now it's the Bucks getting 43 percent and the Nets are way down the line. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. That's disrespect to Kevin Durant. Well, he and brought Kevin, that upon. He brought the disrespect upon himself. He brought that, he brought, Skip, he brought that drama. Remember that drama? Mm -hmm. that, kid, that, that, that drama that he doesn't like? Yeah, all I know about last year was Kevin Durant put up MVP LeBron numbers. didn't? Just didn't play enough games. Le LeBron didn't play enough games. Okay, then. Each of them averaged 30 points. Well, there it is. Kevin Durant's not a bad rebounder. He was at seven. LeBron was at eight. I'll give you that. But LeBron is the best passer in basketball still to this day. I, I sit over here and rave about him. <clears throat> Yet he averaged only six assists last year because he became a three-point shooter. No. Kevin Durant averaged a career-high six assists, so they tied in distributing the basketball. Yes. That's, that's phenomenally great for Kevin Durant. Okay, think about this. So what would have LeBron averaged if he was passing to, let's say, Kyrie? Or he was passing the ball to, say, Seth Curry, mm. as opposed to passing it to Russ and some of the other guys that were bricking the ball. Mm. AD? AD was hurt. AD mm. was there like 10 games. Mm. Me and AD, AD played like 30 games more than me. All I know is this boils down to one simple fact. Kevin Durant can flat out shoot it, and LeBron can't. It's period, end so of so, story. So That's question. what the GMs know. So, so how, he can shoot, he can't. So, so how, I want the guy so who can how did, So how did LeBron average 30? Mm. He can't shoot. Still so how did LeBron go to the basket? Greatest driver of the basketball okay. ever. So he can still do that at 6'9", 260 so, pounds, can, whatever. Can, can I, can ambidextrous I, at the rim. Yeah, say that with me. But here's the, the, my argument. Here's my argument back to you. Hmm. When I say Tom Brady, 
can't do things that Patrick Mahomes. You said Tom doesn't have to do it because he can do it conventional. Well, I say to you, LeBron James doesn't have to shoot the ball from the three as well as KD. Mm. He doesn't have to shoot the ball from the mid-range as good as KD. As long as they're averaging 30, he's averaging 30 just like KD. Uh, bogus argument because LeBron handicaps his team with taking and missing so many free throws and so many three-point shots because Kevin, career high last year, 91% from the free throw line for a, <coughs> excuse me, a seven-footer. Well, that is phenomenal. Well, well it would have helped if he got shooting. to the free throw line against Boston. Mm. Why, why? So why did he shoot against Boston from the free throw line? LeBron last year was 76% from the free throw line. It's, it's good for LeBron and pathetic overall. It's unacceptable. It, it's egregious that a superstar would shoot 76% from the free throw line. It, it's why he should have been in the offseason lab working on his free throw shooting. We'll see if he did. I, I doubt he ever has. Whatever. But the point is that Kevin Durant is one of the best, if not the best, mid-range jump shooter I've ever seen. And I think most people is, have okay, ever seen. Okay, but here's the thing. You got, you got the best mid-range or, or mid-range or three-point shooter. I got the best player. Mm. I mean, I, LeBron James, Le, LeBron I mean, that's like to say the quarterback. He's the best deep ball thrower ever. Okay, Tom Brady's the best quarterback. Mm. So which would you rather be, the best quarterback of all time or the best deep ball thrower of all time? Okay, what's the biggest most important part of an NBA player's arsenal is shooting the basketball. No. It's it. It's scoring the basketball. Oh, okay. It's scoring the basketball. Mm -hmm. And nobody has been able to score the ball at the level my guy has for as long as he has. So That's why 18 straight years, 25 plus. Here's what LeBron James did to his team last year. This is a big reason they won 33 and lost 49. He took the 15th most threes in the league last year. He ranked 93rd in three-point percentage makes. 93rd in the league? Kevin was a little better at 38% to LeBron's 36%. Well, oh, look, hold on. Kevin no, 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 no. The way you framing it, that Kevin Durant is shooting 47% from the three. You mean to tell me he's only two points better than LeBron? Okay, but here's the point. There are a lot of people in between there, a lot of shooters in between 36 and 38 because Kevin ranked 52nd overall in three-point shooting. LeBron is 93rd, so that's 40 notches no, higher no, no. for Kevin because guess what Kevin did? Would you believe he took or attempted only the 72nd most threes in the league? LeBron was 15th. Do the math on that. LeBron is killing his team because he's missing so many more I, threes. I would have thought Durant. the way you was explaining Kevin Durant is at least top 10 in three-point percentage. Well, that was actually low for him because he's a 40% three-point shooter. You know it. Whoa, and whoa. I know so, it. so he was down. Mm -hmm. And some numbers, and he was still and better. Still much better than LeBron. And LeBron was, was up. He was 40 rungs better. LeBron on. was up. Yeah. He was 40 rungs better, and LeBron averaged more points, LeBron, averaged 30 points. LeBron finished 93rd in the league in, in three point shooting. So your guy shoot the By three. By the way, he finished 86th in free throw shoot. 86? Your guy, your guy, your guy shoot the mid range huh. better, the three better, the free throw better. But somehow LeBron they averaged huh. the same amount of points. And here's How's the other possible? problem. Kevin just turned 34 last week, and LeBron's on his way 38. to 38. He's on his way yes. toward 38 on December 30th. And you do realize so, that when LeBron was 34, there was not a question who was the best small forward. Mm. There was no, there was like well, 80%. There was on this side of no, the No, there table. wasn't. No, 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 no. Let this sink in for a second. The man is in his 20th season. And the mere fact that people think he's still top five, although I disagree, I think he's number one. You name the player since they've been doing these rankings. That you remember how Kobe said y'all were some idiots when y'all ranked him what they, what they yeah. ranked him. Mm -hmm. This man is top five. He, he, uh, I think ESPN had a point that say he was the sixth best. Really? Had Kevin Durant ranked behind him. Huh. And that, huh? Well, speaking of when when LeBron was thirty four, we could hark back to like twenty seventeen. Ah, no, 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 huh. no, 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 no. Wait, wait, no, no. wait, what happened in the NBA Finals in twenty seventeen? Oh, well, Kevin Durant saved the day oh, for Golden my, State. Oh, Kevin man. Durant was the MVP of the 2017 Finals and repeated it as the MVP do, of 2018. When LeBron was 34, he was winning the NBA Finals. He was Finals oh. MVP at the age of right four, age of 34. Mm. First team All NBA. Do you remember Finals what happened MVP. in LeBron's house in Game Three of 2017? I remember what happened. To Kevin remember those shots that Kevin made right in his grill? I remember the I remember Ooh. the same shot that that uh, uh, Steph Curry made oh. in his house when he was do down three one in Kevin Durant's grill. Do you remember what Steph had to do? He had to crawl all the way across country to beg Kevin Durant to come and save his legacy against LeBron, which he did. You Kevin do, said, I got you. you do know, I'll come. I'll be MVP in 2017 and 2018, and Golden State will be right again. How many, how many, how many did, did, did Kevin Durant pull on his location, mm -hmm. on his app? 
Mm. So he had to tell her where he was. Yep. Why you do that? Yeah. Uh, God, he wanted it. He mm. wanted it known. Mm. He wanted. He needed them. Skip. I'm not saying Kevin Durant didn't do what you're saying, mm. but this notion that KD didn't need Golden State as much as they needed him is just not true. Mm. Sometime a marriage. It is supposed to be like this. Mm. It works for both parties. Does it? Yeah. Oh. I'm not just getting married because I want to get married. I'm just, she's not just getting married because she wants to say that she's married. Yep, you're Sometimes right. Sometimes it works for both parties. Kevin said, I want the heat. I want the pressure. I want, I want the NBA world to say, okay, you're on, Kevin. I want the, you I want, be the I want the culture. I want the great leadership of Steph, Clay, and Draymond. And I just want to be able to sit back in the back. So if things go around, they don't blame me. Mm. Guess what? Who is the the difference maker in 2017 and 2018 anybody will tell you it was Kevin Durant Who the, the seven foot monster so so what was he in 2021 why couldn't mm. he be a different maker last year mm. Steph Curry was a difference maker now Steph got two without KD how many championships does KD have without Stephen Curry Stephen Wardell Curry how many titles Mm. You know what happened last year? Yeah, I know what Just happened. Just the way LeBron was handicapped by Westbrook, nah. Kevin Durant was handicapped by Kyrie in his I won't get vaccinated mm -hmm. stance. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mm -hmm. If I'm not mistaken, I could have so, uh, swore I saw Kyrie Irving. Guys, did y'all see Kyrie Irving on the court for those four games against Boston? Maybe I got to go get me a new TV. Damn. Mm. But, you know, they just had uh, the electronic convention out in Vegas. Mm -hmm. uh, it's coming up. I'm going to go out there and see the new flat panel TV. Because really? my TV my TV glitching again. Because really? I could have swore I saw Kyrie Irving really? get swept alongside really? KD. Well, you didn't see much during the regular season, did you? I'm talking about the playoffs. Mm. You told me to play regular season don't matter. Let's you told me it's about playoffs. Kevin told, who was it, Mike James, before the playoffs started, we're done. He should be disqualified. Yeah. Yep. Let LeBron, oh, can, I can just imagine. We are done. No, no, no. I, done. Can, Im I can imagine what Skip Bayless would say mm -hmm. if somebody, if a call got out that LeBron before the playoffs said, we're done. Well, I can just imagine guess what, what this man would have said. LeBron didn't have to say we're done because they were done because they missed the play-in tournament. And you were missed done. The who picked that? Who picked that? Wow. Who said your Boston Celtics going to beat the brakes off you? Uh, the guy over here uh, and got some cases off of you uh, and going to get some more, too. Until the finals when I got them all back. Hold on, Skip. Yeah. Hold, you, you got them back when? Mm, finals. It, well, I, I thought 72% I thought say the, the Brooklyn Nets.